for a little pop talk today. We are starting with a scary encounter for Arnold Schwarzenegger. Didn't this elephant know who he was up against? <laughs> Didn't he know the Terminator was in? This action star was on safari in South Africa when the Jeep he was in came across a bull elephant. Yes, uh -oh. so the animal had a bit of a stare uh -oh. down with the Jeep before walking off the road. And just as the Jeep starts to pass, the elephant charges. Come on. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Look at and that. You think he's just going to pass. Not quite. And then he's coming back around. Yeah, watch out. Oh, you. yikes. Uh, you couldn't have written this encounter into a movie. See, he's coming back. Oh, look at him. Look at that. Time to go. That's like a Jurassic Park scene. It but in real life, is. isn't that wild? Absolutely. Yeah. So Schwarzenegger posted the video online saying that he couldn't have written the encounter better, even if it was in a movie, just like Chuck said. Wow. You know, it's a risk you take. One of the most powerful animals on the planet. All right, there is some concern over the new Star Wars spinoff that's due out later this year, right? Yes, so Rogue One has been ordered by Disney to undergo several weeks of reshoots. So this comes after ex executive screen rough cuts of the film, and sources tell The Hollywood Reporter that the movie as it stands didn't fit the Star Wars mold and is more of a war movie. So. Hmm. So Disney wouldn't comment directly on the report, but uh, they say the reshoots are going to happen. It's a typical process. You know, most people don't know this, but that happens a lot. When we had movies right. in the state, mm -hmm. they'd come back months and months later and they'd reshoot a little scene or they didn't like it. Or in this case, there is a rumor that maybe it doesn't have that tongue in cheek humor mm -hmm. that a lot of Star Wars right. movies have. So maybe that's what they're going to add. We'll see. But yeah. speaking of Disney, mm -hmm. the company has confirmed who will star in the upcoming sequel to the classic movie, Mary Poppins. Are you into sequels? Love. Of classics? Is this okay that we done have a well, scene? done well? That's my yeah. Only Emily Blunt uh, will star as the nanny from the clouds, right? And Lin Manuel Miranda of Hamilton fame will play a new character, a street lamplighter named Jack. Very interesting. Yeah. yeah, the story surrounds Poppins' return to meet the bank's children. This is Jane and Michael, who are all grown up and now have children of their own. Yes, so the movie will be released in theaters Christmas Day of 2018. Super califragilisticexpialidocious. Okay. Yeah. Well, done so. well, done well. <laughs> so a Hollywood star has made good on a promise. Gina Rodriguez from Jane the Virgin lent the dress that she wore to the Golden Globes in 2015 to a teenage stranger. Yeah, this is interesting. Jessica Casanova tweeted Rodriguez back in March saying she would copy her look for prom and was asking if she could borrow the dress. Obviously, yes. kind of, you know, this is just, just fun. Right. You never right. thought, you never think right. you'll get an answer. But guess what? Rodriguez said yes. And last weekend made <laughs> good on the promise. So the gown is a by Bagley Mishka, and not many people can say that they wore the same dress as a Golden Globe winning actress. Isn't that a Isn't sweet that thing lovely? to do on the say nice to something day, you know, yeah. somebody day? There you go. She looks do great. Do something nice. Yeah. Very sweet.